Hello, dear viewers. Happy April 1st. I would have done a joke where I play a completely separate game, but I couldn't think of a good one. So, we're just jumping back into Madness Project Nexus. I hope that's fine with you. Well, there's 364 days where it won't be April 1st, so you can disregard that. Last time, I got to the Nexus Core facility and had to play on Taurus in order to make it through. So I went ahead and got through the next four waves, and actually, I spent some time getting all of my skills, most of my skills. I'm only missing these five ones from Unarmed. But I got the, I got the rest. Specifically, Stunning Fist. Oh yes. Oh yes. That should make this relatively easy. So we're just gonna jump right in. How's your day been going, by the way? Mine has been going fine. I got some ice water here. You know what, how about you take this entire loading screen, I'll let it stay longer, and you can go get something to drink. Okay, guys, I think all the people who are actually going to get something to drink have left. I'm going to give you a little secret. I'm going to be playing more Elden Ring. Crazy, right? I know. I upload those on, like, Saturday or Sunday on the weekend. It's, like, Sa Samurai Saturday. Listen, you can go watch that. Oh, only, only you know it exists. Those people getting drinks, they don't know it exists, okay? Well, I hope you have your drinks ready, because here we go. These traffic cones are certainly not ready for the kind of chaos they're about to endure. You just gotta get up to ten here. Or have it be interrupted. I'm trying to counter these boys. I don't have counter or melee blocking. See, it's always another guy who ruins everything. And I'm not even stunning them. See? I got up to 20. 22. There. This is what I want to do. I want to pummel people. Why didn't you melee me? Like, I'm, the whole point of me learning to counter is so that they can, you know, drop themselves. Whatever. Let's take their guns. Enough fists. Talk is cheap. What was that? Something just dropped from the skies. I completely forgot. I mean, it's not like you can hear the music much anyway on this level. Ow. Again, ow! Aw, oh, he got me. He wasn't supposed to shoot me. These guys are making, like, quick work of my face, because I don't have a shotgun. Honestly, I just need a shotgun. Wasn't there a... Yeah, there was one over here. Stop knocking me over, thanks. And now it begins. Listen, I wanted to do the whole fist thing, but it's just so much easier to grab a shotgun. Mainly because the guys with the, the electric sticks haven't come out yet, which I find is the quickest way to kill everyone here. Look, it's Morris! I wish Morris would heal me when he gets kills, or at least attacks. Stop shooting me. You don't get to shoot me. Now one of these guys ha it has no ammo. Wow. Seriously? I just wanted to use a shotgun and they're like, oh it's out of ammo! How inconsiderate. Now on the list of things that I wanted to talk about, because I write stuff down at this point because my memory is so terrible. Like you've seen my memory be terrible. I forget stuff while I'm talking about it. Which is insane. But, I guess it's just something I have to learn to live with. Or maybe I've learned to live with it. Nice shield, loser. On the list of things I have to talk about here, uh, if you didn't watch my last video, in terms of this video's upload time, my last video was Halo Wars 2 Part 5, and I played that with my friend! Actually, we played the previous one together, too, so if you haven't seen that, go ahead and check him out. You might like him, or you might like both of us together and our, I guess, insane, I don't know, duality? 
another shotgun, please. This must be what it's like to go shopping. None of these particularly have a lot of ammo. I guess we'll grab this one. But we got our stun batons, shock batons. I guess those are the same thing. Oh no, you might like my friend in Halo Wars 2. Nah. Oh yeah, I also unlocked the ability to make poles, which honestly, I'm not used to having that ability, so I forget to make them all the time. Alright, so coming off the elevator here, we head left and grab one of these rifles. It's incredibly powerful, as long as you're somewhat accurate with it. And then we'll be taking the shotgun from this man. He doesn't need it. Watch the telekinetic people. They can and will kill you. I think they're only our allies, though. He's the only one I've noticed. Gotta break those for good luck. Allies throwing a bit of a rage fit here. Really, dude? The vending machine? Really? That guy's a bit of a prick. I don't know why they let him on this team. So a large group of enemies comes through here, but we should be able to take care of most of them because they are unshielded and we do have something to take care of them with headshots. There we go. I couldn't get past the second wave. Luckily, none of these guys have two dangerous weapons. Except this guy, he has his fists. But he's been dealt with. Problem quelled. That guy has a brute shot, he will shoot me with it. Like that. Bit of a pain, especially when you take damage. There we go, the telekinetic man is going in. He got destroyed by a shotgun. Alright, first area cleared. Now we get to this little, I guess this is um some kind of like quarters? I don't really know, there's a lot of guys shooting at you. Gotta watch out for these guys down there. One of them has a battle rifle. Luckily they're all kind of using projectile weapons, so you can strafe back and forth and avoid most of the damage. We got the majority of them. That guy is going to try and punch us to death, though. Like he's doing an unarmed build or something. There we go. Now we head up these stairs here. Get a checkpoint and head into the first airlock. There's some enemies up here that will shoot you. But you can take him out pretty quickly with the battle rifle. Like I said, it's very useful. Like, all these guys with no shields, you can just pretty much eliminate without any competition. Now, the real problem here is these guys like to stay under here and don't come out. Like that man did. These guys are all popping up out of the door here. Out of the airlock? What is it? Out of the ship. They're coming out of the boarding ship. That guy has a shield. Well, I was hoping that'd do more damage, but the brute in the front here was incredibly heavyweight, didn't want his allies to go first. We all know someone like that. So this this man down there, there's still that guy with a battle rifle, and I think there's a man with a shotgun or an SMG hiding behind this crate. We'll get him out of there with a grenade. But that should clear out all the guys in this room. Check it out. Hey, check it out. The Malt is already I just said board. that. Stop copying me. Malta, what There's is a your dead marine over? here with an SMG. He definitely won't be making it back. I don't believe it. They're retreating. We won. Did they? Did you win? That's a victory explosion. This is bad. Real bad. Whoops. There we go. Now over here, we're going to have a few allies joining us in the fight. One of them is going to be uh, an ultra elite. So hopefully he'll get enraged and pull out his sword, which will be a very good distraction because he has a lot of health and a lot of shields. 
There's a shotgun man over here we're gonna have to deal with. Another thing we have to worry about is our teammates trying to team kill us with grenades. I do not know why. Maybe it's because I'm stealing all their kills. But they will try and kill us. They're just jealous. I can just wipe out all the guys as they come through. Very easy. They're rather hesitant to come out. Uh. Yeah. I think we got them all, though. Hey, they're leaving the Athens. I don't know what happened to our friendly elite. Usually over here somewhere. Did he die? Oh, he fell down here. Cortana, assessment. I'm going to push him up to the door and get to watch the madness happen. Because that's why you're here, for the madness. Here we go. Yeah, he's incredibly powerful. Pretty much one shots everything. They should really nerf this guy before the next update comes out. There's another one over here. We come up here. There's two Marines that have just taken out the sergeant. We need to deal with them and their insurrection. If we didn't kill the... Uh, oh, nope. Plasma grenade got him. We're good. He likes to sneak up here and grab me while I'm taking the ammo. Very handsy. They come out of here, so we're going to throw a grenade. Deal with all these guys. Again, shotgun. Watch for the second turret. Shoot this guy, shoot that guy, take out the turret, get a grenade over there. Jump off of his friend. I'm pretty sure that was his friend hitting him. But get that turret out of there with a well-placed grenade. There's some zealots over there that are going to be a problem. They would be a problem if you can just jump over it, skip it. Now we head over here to where Johnson, 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 and Miranda, Miranda, and Miranda are all waiting for us. So we gotta go clear the way for them. I don't know why they can't do anything themselves. That's six guns right there, combined with a seventh generic Marine. Crewman, whatever. Over here, there is a telekinetic master that pops in here. But the shotgun can make quick work of him too. Shotgun makes quick work of pretty much everyone in here. You jump up here, Deal with the flood on top. He's holding a pistol. What an idiot. And then this guy with a jetpack. Sir, borders have did I get him? I didn't get him. They have a bomb. He didn't move. You it? Yes, well, that's his fault. To make contact with the detonator. Chief, keep on moving through here. Double time. Cortana, prioritize targets and fire at will. See, you can hear what we're trying to do. We gotta go get rid of that bomb. We, we just got no time to waste, so we're gonna throw some grenades down here to deal with all these guys. We're gonna kill two bugs to fly up. There's a bunch of other guys sitting here on the top. It doesn't really matter. Because you can just jump through like this. I shouldn't have wasted all my grenades. But hey. There we go. These guys were kind enough to give me some. Throw a grenade in there for those guys. The carriers are breaking through, sir. They're heading straight for the Cairo. Cortana, concentrate your fire on the There we go. Admiral, do what you can. I gotta reload my shotgun real quick. There are a few guys up ahead. We probably won't be using the shotgun for them, so I could reload it in the next elevator. No, I was wrong. Good thing I reloaded this. Because I guess if you have a jetpack, you fly directly into a man wielding a shotgun. Well, if you've ever seen the Madness Combat episodes, yeah. Oh boy, that man just disemboweled my friend. I'm gonna run at him with a spoon. There are quite a few elites guarding the bomb. You may need to get creative. Yeah, so in here we have to, we actually have to get creative. There are a lot of elites guarding the bombs. The Covenant got smart here and made them all zealots. Unfortunately, we can grab one of their swords. 
And we can pretty much lunge kill all of them in one shot. And there we go. We can stop the bomb by planting a grenade on it. Ooh, fruit juice. Let's see if I can get a grenade up here. We're being ambushed. Yeah. Yeah, you are. Man, I'm going nuts. Look at me. The shock batons actually are leaking battery acid into my bloodstream, and that's why I'm shaking so hard. Here we are. The final level. The, set, the penultimate level. I'll need to beat the final boss without using any... Pretty much anything. I mean, I'll be able to grab their stuff. It's just I can't go in with it, so... Getting there might be a pain. Because those robots can't be finished. They can't be, like, stunned or whatever. Which sucks, because it'd be really cool if you could rip their arms off and kill them with it. Glory kills, like in Doom. See? They just pistol with me. Like, what is the point of getting close to me with a gun if you're just gonna hit me? You wanna get close? I get close. I got buckshot. Buckshot for all of you. All right, you think you can just come in here and take over the tower that you already own? You've got another thing coming. Kermit the Frog is here to dish out the pain. I'm gonna send you to Kokomo even further. Listen, I don't know why everyone and their dad can do a Kermit impression. Like really, think about it. How come everyone, like every other person in the world, can, can do Kermit? Like, apparently, Kermit the Frog is an easy impression to do! Oh, he's dead! I didn't even take out his other corpus. Man, it's nice being able to... Quad damage! It's nice being able to, like, kill enemies. Look, he doesn't even get a chance. Neither did those guys. Oh, whoops. I forgot electric attacks do that. Oh, right, they're gonna nerf this game soon. We'll nerf some of the stuff that arena mode uses. Like on the bright side, enemies won't be able to uh, be immune to damage when what is it? They're falling? They have the plummet skill? Pfft. Oh. I thought I did that to the big guy and I was very confused. See, I wish I could pummel people faster. Ow. Yeah, yeah. Who's laughing now? Oh, right, I can move. I forgot I, I'm not stuck anymore. I keep forgetting that I have skills I can use. Did, really? That was your tactic? He just kind of turned around and let me hit him. His friend punched me. All right, fine. Here, have a grenade. We gotta get rid of the guy with no tack bar, and then we gotta get rid of the. Not only do they have tack bars, they have two corpus. This man is nothing. See, he's just a ninja. He can be easily countered with kung fu. That's what I am. I'm a homeless man who got kung fu lessons to avenge my family. Do you know the meme I'm talking about? It was that it was a man holding up a sign like lost family due to ninja attack need money for kung fu training. That's that's what happened. I lost everything and learned kung fu. So now I can pummel people with my hands, take their weapons and murder them. Like that.
Well, I wanted to finish it with a shotgun. I'll finish it with my foot. What can I do to you, pal? Nothing, apparently. He doesn't care that I just hit him with a hammer. I missed time to block. Excuse me? Okay. You're gonna suffer. I need that attack bar back, buddy. Thank you. I was hitting your friend. Stop it. Look, see, his tack bar's gone. Ninja's tack bar is gone. Okay, I'm mistiming all of my blocks. It's like parrying in Elden Ring. Okay, so what I want to say is, on Elden Ring, my idea is I'm going to play as Magic Samurai and just, I guess, slowly become Virgil from Devil May Cry 5. Okay, Devil May Cry, he's not just in 5. I think he's in, like, every one of them. No, all four of them. One, three, four, and five. At least I think. I've never actually played the first the, the uh, first three. I only played five. I can perfect block that, which is weird. That would have been a perfect opportunity to make it so that you dodge the side when you do that, but... You keep grabbing me. Stop it. You know, say goodbye to your helmet, chucklehead. Ow, did you have to hit me with the hammer? I missed both shots. I was supposed to, like, avenge myself. Get that hammer out of here. I missed time to block. It's okay. Again with the hammer. See, I can't hurt him. It's the plummet skill, where they don't take damage while they're on the ground. They're gonna remove that in a patch. The next update or whatever. Along with the fact that apparently, the... What is it? The half mag suit was becoming available for purchase way too early. No. Bad dog. So that you can't get the half mag stuff anymore as early anyway, which is a real bummer because I was going to do an agent only playthrough where I only use stuff the agents use. I don't know if that applied to skills or not because I don't know what skills they have. I don't, there's no way for me to check that. Triple damage! Who wants to get hurt? Three times as much! Any more shotguns? More shotguns. Fine. I'll just finish him off. Come here. Dodge this. He didn't dodge it. Haha. Uh -huh. Yeah, that this dude with a baton, his nightstick, survived longer than that man with, like, I guess combat training with two swords. Though, why don't they have smoke bombs to ambush me? He didn't like that. I'm up to 50 combo. Get out of here, loser. Later. Can you stop shooting at me? I don't appreciate it. I have shotguns on my back for when I get infinite ammo. See, I told you I forget everything, which is weird because I didn't forget that. I was gonna kick him and see if it'd kill him. Kick. It just it just made him stand up. It did the opposite of what I wanted it to do. Nope. You know, you just don't understand the power of counters. That's why Royal Guard is so broken in Devil May Cry. I just snapped his neck! No. Yeah, I guess I should deal with this guy. 
Bye. Where'd he go? <laughs> oh, he's dead! <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so slow while I'm carrying it. We need to drop it then. This sniper hurts, especially since it pierces through my non-existent defenses. Like, look at it. It's The sniper itself is so long, it just goes straight through my straitjacket. Oh, I'm out of grenades. You know, I'll have this one in case I can't reach the minigun with the infinite ammo. Well, I mean, it's not like it matters. There's only like six enemies left. Well, five. Oh, look, just what the doctor ordered. Oh, he's dead. He lost one of his corpus. What an idiot. And you're an idiot for letting me kill you. But also very polite. Thank you. Who's... Taking your jolly good time, huh? Yeah? Enjoy that heavy armor, pal. My spine has been shattered in four separate locations. Just like yours. Haha, uh -huh. you don't have a helmet anymore. Everyone can see how ugly you are. Actually, never mind, I can't see you at all. Get out of my sight. No. Your turn. Come on, who wants to wrestle with me? Yeet! I love the power of the Yeetimus. Smash. He just doesn't care. Can I just... real quick? Yep, real quick. Look, infinite ammo! I mean, it doesn't really help me. Stare into the sun, I guess. He does he never learns. He's he's just like me. He never learns. I'm just gonna punch you through the helmet. I'm such a lunatic, I'm punching people through their riot helmets and stuff. Get that off so I can punch you in the eyes. Like a good Fallout 1 player. Just gonna go straight for the eyes. Oh, I wanted to use the minigun. While you're still alive, come down here for me. Arena victory. Told you I wanted to use the minigun. Just wish I got infinite ammo for it. It's just so fun. It's so fun to play as heavy weapons guy. You know, as a homeless man, I probably don't have training to use that, nor should I have that. And granted, I could probably sell it for, like, what, at least a couple hundred thousand dollars? It costs, what, six hundred thousand? I could have enough to buy a home. Also, if you haven't noticed, my blood is green. Because I'm insane. But with training, we can get everything! Well, we can get one thing. You know what? Melee guard, check that out. More strength. We, we aren't gonna get any... <laughs> Anything else other than strength and endurance and endurance is our encumbrance and we don't have armor With all that said and done we can finally get out of here and by that I mean go to sleep It's the end of the episode guys episode. I don't even know what episode it is What like 58 59? I think it's crazy. It got this far. It's crazy that I have triple digit views on these videos, but I'm not complaining yet So thanks a lot for watching. I hope you have a good rest of your day and take care. I'll catch you next time